Hello, my name is Zach Kessmer and this is my camp story. First time I went to camp, uh, I just moved here um, and I've been here a while, um, but I hadn't really gotten into a church yet. So this is the really first big step into a church. I was nervous, but optimistic going into camp. I had felt nervous and expecting a lot because everyone where I'd moved from had just talked about how amazing it was. It was it was better than what I expected. When I went in, I think I knew like two people that were in my cabin. When I arrived at camp, I felt isolated, not lonely. But when I got into my cabin, it was just, it was great. We were perfect fits for each other. We still are today. My experience at camp that first week, it was kind of like a big question and answer session directly from God to people. So at the end of the week, they gave us an opportunity to dedicate our lives to Jesus. And I was already a Christian before, but I had understood a lot more in that one week than I had ever understood in the other years of my life. And when they asked us to stand up, I didn't at first. And they asked again, and I didn't at first. And they asked a third time, and uh, I didn't stand up. But then, after the pastor had told everyone to sit down who had stood up and dedicated their lives to Jesus, he said, I pray for you who haven't stood up and that you would find the courage to tell somebody. And I had decided. So later that night, I took my cabin leader aside and told him. And then later that night, he told the rest of our cabin and it was the best moment of my life. Since I made that decision, my life has changed a lot and knowing Jesus brings understanding and there's just so much love everywhere. I really like this verse. Um, it's Romans 12, 2 and it says, Do not conform to the pattern of this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind. Then you will be able to test and approve what God's will is, His good, pleasing, and perfect will. I'm a very questioning person and just seeing a verse that says it's okay to question and to doubt and through that process you will still find God. It, it's been true so far. Everything that I've questioned has come out the other end with God on the winning side. I believe that he is truly beautiful and wonderful. Just go. I mean, just go. There are things stopping you. Eh, just go anyway. Something I've learned through questioning and doubting is that at a certain point, you just have to do, so just do something and see where it takes you. My name is Zach Kessmer and this has been my camp story.